basic information you need to know before purchasing. To avoid choosing the wrong product, please follow this video to check compatibility prior to purchasing. Attention! These RF products are not available for pacemaker carrier as well as people with severe hearing loss. Part 1 TV or AV devices audio output checking. Step 1 Audio out ports checking. Digital optical audio out. On some devices, it is labeled as SPDIF or TOSLINK and there will be a red laser in while the TV is broadcasting. This port is frequently used for smart TV systems. RCA audio out. There are many pairs of red and white RCA jacks on the back of the TV AV devices, but what we need must be labeled as audio out, or output, or line out, or AV out. Sometimes at the rear of the AV receiver or Blu-ray disc player, two channel is labeled in order to distinguish from 5.1 channel or 7.1 channel speaker systems audio out. But at the rear of most kinds of AV boxes connected to TV, the RCA and optical audio ports are just labeled as audio and digital audio. Some RCA ports labeled as component in or AV in or video in or audio in are not suitable. 3.5 mm audio out. On some devices, it is marked with a headphone icon. If you watch TV with your family, we usually don't recommend connecting to this port. It may disable the TV speaker. If your TV or TV-related AV device only has this port available, we suggest you try this function by a wired headphone. Digital Coaxial Audio Out On some devices, it is labeled as SPDIF. It is seldomly used. Only some old TV systems remain this port. If your TV or TV-related AV device only has this port available, you have to buy a digital to analog converter for installation. We usually call RCA in 3.5 mm as analog audio ports, optical and coaxial as digital ones. Optical and RCA audio out ports are frequently used for TV systems. If you enjoy TV programs from multiple AV sources, such as cable box, DVD as well as streaming media, Netflix, Amazon Prime Video, etc. Then you have to hook up your Simolio unit to the TV's audio output directly. But if you only enjoy TV programs from one fixed AV device, such as cable box or Blu-ray disc player, etc., you can set up your Simolio unit with the related AV device too. So according to your own situation, check your TV or TV-related AV device's audio output first. Step 2. TV sound out options checking. For some TVs, you need to check the sound out options first, such as LG or Samsung TV or some other old models. If you only enjoy TV programs from one fixed AV device and plan to set up the Simolio unit with it, please skip Step 2. For TV connection situation, the most ideal TV sound out option is internal plus external mode that can make sure Simolio unit and the TV speakers work simultaneously. Let's take LG TV as an example. For TV optical audio out connection, select internal TV speaker plus optical. If your TV only has single sound out available, you will need to choose external speaker to work with an external audio device. But the TV's internal speakers will become disabled once you choose external speakers as your TV's audio output. This is a TV's feature and its availability depends on your TV's design. Note: 
If you would like to enjoy TV programs with your family together, you will need to buy some external speakers and corresponding cable splitter to set up as follows. Step three: audio format checking and setting for digital audio connection. For setting up with digital optical audio output of your TV slash AV device, make sure your TV and TV related AV device can be set to PCM audio format. Almost all the digital wireless audio products do not decode Dolby or DTS. Let's take Samsung TV as an example. Press Home on your smart remote to access the home screen. Then Settings, Sound. Expert settings, audio format. Then select PCM. Note: Setting menu depends on different TVs. Please refer to your TV manual for details. Part two: Tips for choosing your Simoleo digital wireless TV headsets. Simoleo digital wireless TV headsets support digital optical connection as well as analog RCA and 3.5 millimeters aux connections. Three different audio cables included: digital optical cable for digital connection, RCA and 3.5 millimeters aux cable for analog connections. In the end, only one of these cables is needed to complete the installation. If you enjoy TV programs from multiple AV sources, such as cable box, DVD, as well as streaming media, for example Netflix, Amazon Prime, then you have to hook up your Simoleo unit to the TV's audio output directly. But if your TV has only one optical audio output, which is occupied by a sound bar, you have to buy a splitter for installation. Or if you only watch TV programs from one fixed AV device, such as cable box or Blu-ray disc player, you can also set up your Simoleo unit to that AV device. Note: the under-chain design headset will put pressure on your ears if you wear it for a long time. For choosing the most suitable Simoleo unit, please refer to the product comparison table below. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or hesitations when making the decision, be sure to contact us.